Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Rebecca Rice and I teach family photographers to gain a life of freedom through a thriving photography business. In today's video, we are talking all about Imagine AI and how to use their custom editing profiles. And so if you don't know what that means, don't worry, I'm gonna walk you through all the things. Um, but if you are brand new to Imagine AI, you've never heard of it, you're like, what is this? Um, go watch my previous two videos. Uh, the first I talk through, you know, explaining what Imagine AI is, how it works for, um, you know, to be implemented into your editing workflow and all the things. And then in the video after that, which was my, my previous video, um, I give a full like walkthrough tutorial sharing my screen of how to edit an, a, a uh, session with Imagine AI from start to finish. And so um, you can go watch those too. But in this video, I wanted to walk through how to use an AI editing profile, what your options are and things like that. Now, um, if you're brand new to Imagine AI, like I said um, before, then those videos will be helpful for you. But I also wanted to let you know that I do have um, a, the, a link for you guys in the description of this video that will get you 1500 free edits with Imagine AI. And so it's a nice big trial. Um, a typical family session for me is somewhere around 100 images. And so that can get you a lot of family sessions for free just to give it a try. And so the link for that is in the description. Um, this is That's 500 more edits than if you were just to like go to their website. Um, so definitely check that out. Um, okay, so let me go over here into Imagine AI and let's get into all things editing profiles. So um, the way that Imagine AI works is it doesn't edit based off of presets, it edits based off of what it calls AI profiles. And what this does is it's it doesn't just slap a preset on your photos when you submit a catalog, it actually individually edits every single photo depending on the settings for that photo, um, how it was shot, all the things, um, because it has learned your editing style. It is fascinating with how, um, how accurate it is, how um, close it gets to a final edit, it's wild. Um, and like I said, if you wanna see this in action, watch my previous video and I'll like show you actually, you know, Imagine AI actually editing the photos, how fast it is. It is crazy fast. It does it in minutes. Um, but I wanted to show you your options for AI profiles because that's what drives this machine um, is the AI profile that you choose to have it edit with essentially. So inside Imagine AI, you can see I have my custom editing profile here, um, which I'll talk about in just a second. Um, but if you go over to click add profile, here are kind of their options that you have for editing with a profile. Um, the first is their new newest, it's still in beta, that basically, you know, it's a light personal AI profile where you upload a preset that you use and you answer like a short little survey and it creates kind of like its best guess for um, a profile for you to get started with. Now, this is not the best option and they will tell you that. <laughs> Obviously, it's not recommended. Um, this is not the best option because it's going to take time uh, for this profile to really learn your editing style. Um, typically, it takes 3,000 to 5,000 edited images for a profile to really get fine-tuned, um, and that's just going to take time and experience. And so um, this is an option, but it's one that I would not recommend. Um, let me talk about the other options. So we have um, right here is to create a personal AI profile. So it says starting with 3,000 photos, I believe it actually does recommend doing at least 5,000 um, to get it really fine-tuned. Um, so you can create basically 
upload 5,000 edited images in Lightroom catalogs, and it'll create this custom profile to you. Um, this is great, but the problem that you know we've come across with a lot of my students is they don't have that many edited images um, that show a consistent style that they love. Either you know your your style has changed recently, and you know you you don't have enough images to um, really show your current style. Or you know you're newer and you don't have 5,000 edited images to be able to create a custom profile. Um, there are other solutions, so stick with me. Okay, the, the third option that it has here is to use what they call a talent AI profile. So these are other photographers' profiles that you can kind of scroll through and see if there's one that matches your style. Um, so that's you know kind of the third option now we do have a very um new option that i'm so excited about i've been working with imagine ai um very closely and so you see that i have my custom ai profile so i uploaded my 5,000 images it learned my editing style so if you're a student of mine um or and you like use my presets or love my style maybe you're new to the world of rebecca rice photography um, and you just like my style, like if you go to my Instagram at Rebecca Rice Photography and you like what you see, and that's a style that you're trying to emulate, my custom editing profile is actually now available for you to purchase and use in your Imagine AI, which is so exciting. That was a big thing that whenever I was talking to Imagine, because I've been using Imagine um, for my associate team for over a year and a half. We were one of their earliest adopters, which I didn't realize at the time, <laughs> but we were. Um, so we've been using them for quite some time. And this AI editing profile is very fine-tuned and it's exactly how I would edit you know, a, a gallery. So if, if you were to purchase my custom AI profile and put it into Imagine, it's as if you have a clone of me editing your photos. So it doesn't just slap a preset on, you know, if you have my presets, which is great, um, but it doesn't just slap my preset on and call it a day. What it's doing is it's fine tuning every single photo as if I were the one in your computer fine tuning and editing that gallery and I, this is seriously revolutionary you guys it's wild with how specific that it can get and like i said go watch my previous video to watch it in action um but i wanted to let you know that that, that is a very viable option for you um to use my editing profile that has been fine-tuned to match my signature style and now that can be shared with you as well. So that link is in the description. If you want to go check that out, um, you can get your five, 1500, not 500, your 1500 free edits. And also, um, so you, you can download your, or download, you can get your 1500 free edits and you can, um, get my custom AI editing profile, both in the description here. Um, for those of you that are like, what is this gonna cost me after my 1500 free edits? You guys, this is only five cents an image to edit, which is crazy cheap because if you were to use a um, private editor or something like that, a typical cost you're looking at is like 34 cents an image right now in the industry, um, which is totally fair for private editors. But with Imagine AI, five cents an image is hard to beat. And so for um, a full session, you're looking at like five, six dollars to edit the entire full session, which is crazy. Now you're still gonna need to go in and um, you know fine tune the edits a little bit at the end, uh, just like you would if you were using a private editor. You're still gonna wanna put your fingerprints on the photos, but it dramatically speeds up your editing workflow. I mean, it is wild how many hours my team has saved by using our AI software editing profile and the best part is it just in integrates right into the Lightroom. And so I can't tell you enough how much I recommend this and definitely give it a try if you've never tried it. Um, and check out those options for an editing profile if you want to, um, you know, if you have those 5,000 photos to be able to create your own, awesome. If not, use mine. And I think you'll be really pleasantly surprised with how well and that, you know, this works for you and speeds up your workflow like crazy. Because at the end of the day, that's what this is about for me. It's about 
you know, I, I teach photographers to gain a life of freedom and the freedom that you're going to experience by saving literally hours, not being glued behind your computer, you know, editing in Lightroom is going to be crazy for you. I, I like, I'm so excited to hear the stories of freedom that you experience because you get to spend more time with your family, um, while Imagine AI edits for you in the background. So give it a try. It's linked in the description. You can also grab my custom AI editing profile. If you have any questions at all about Imagine AI or using editing profiles or anything like that, drop them here in the description and I would love to come through and answer them. Odds are if you have a question, somebody else probably has a very similar question and so it'll be helpful for them too. Um, so drop your questions and I'd love to come through and help you guys. So with that, we'll go ahead and close and I'll see you back next week with another episode. Bye guys.